Hey everyone, welcome back. Uh, I'm going to do a different type of video today. Uh, I'm going to show how to tie some basic flies today and over the next few weeks. Um, this particular fly right here is called the maple syrup fly. It, uh, it's an original fly for the state of Maine and I'll put more information about it in the description in the video. And I'm going to show you how to tie it. It's a pretty easy fly to tie and it won't take you long at all. The reason why I uh, decided to do some of these is uh, fly tyings are a pretty fun hobby to take up, especially during the winter time. If you uh, happen to live in a uh, state that has a real winter with cold and snow and frozen over lakes and you don't really do much, but you do a lot of fishing during the spring and summer and the fall, uh, it's a good hobby to take up during the winter time. And I'm hoping this maybe will introduce some people to the uh, to the hobby. So anyway, I'm using some tan thread. You can uh, could also use black for a tail. You use a yellow kip tail. You just tie it on here at the end. Fingers are a little rough. Wind your way back up to the front. Some loose pieces off there. Next you want to take some uh, some tan chenille. The stuff I'm using is uh, they consider it fine. I usually like to go with something that's a little thicker. So you tie this in here. And tie it down to the uh, tie-in point of the tail. Work your way back up. And then just wrap it up towards the front. I don't know if there's any other videos out there of doing this particular fly, but like with any fly, if you look it up, on YouTube, you look up five different videos and they'll show you five different ways to do it. Everyone does it a little differently. And believe it or not, that's about it right there. It's tying a nice little head. Use your uh, knot of choice. Just like that, it's done. You put on a little head cement. There you have it. That's the uh, maple syrup fly. You can uh, also substitute um, yellow hackle for the tail. Some of the stuff right here. Pinch a little bit of it off and use it for a tail. That works pretty well too. So anyway, there it is. Thanks for watching. Check out my other videos. I do a lot of uh, fishing videos and uh, other outdoor type stuff. So. Subscribe. Thanks for watching.